Good morning, guys. It is Monday, January 28th, which means today is the first day back to classes of the new semester. It is around 9.20 in the morning. I just woke up, quickly curled my hair, and threw my shirt on. I'm getting ready to sit down and throw a little bit of makeup on. I don't usually wear makeup on an everyday basis while at school, but first day back, want to look good, want to feel good, want to start off on the right note. So I thought I would check in with you guys quickly, say good morning. I'm going to go throw some makeup on and then we will chat. So I just threw on very little makeup. Also look at the rainbow on my head. I just threw on brows, mascara, tiny bit of highlighter and a little bit of a lip. It is around 10 o'clock right now. I'm really hungry. I'm going to eat some cereal before I leave for my first class. So my first class is at 11. It is clinical and abnormal psychology. I actually have a friend in that class, so I'm excited. I'm not going to be alone. <clears throat> but since my class is at 11, I like to leave a half hour early for class always, no matter what the class is. So I can grab some coffee on the way and like get there with enough time to get a seat. And of course, save one for my friend. So yes, it's 10 o'clock right now. I'm going to just have a quick bowl of cereal and I'm going to get fully dressed. I'm literally just in my shirt and my pajama shorts right now. So yes, I need to go find a spoon. I didn't buy any yesterday when I went to Target. So I think I have to go steal one from my roommate. So let's go see. All right, it was a fail. I actually did not have a spoon, but I was able to find one. In the bottom of my drawer, I definitely need to go steal some spoons from the dining halls today or I won't be able to eat any cereal. I'm just going to have original Special K. I picked this up at Target yesterday and unsweetened vanilla almond milk. And then I'm going to get dressed. I'll show you guys my outfit and then we will head to Starbucks to grab some coffee before class. So while I eat my cereal, I thought I would just quickly update you guys on my day. So, like I said, my first class is at 11. Then I was supposed to have class at 2.30, but they said it was canceled. Like, it's a Monday-Wednesday class, and they said only come on Wednesday. So, I have class at 11, and then I don't have class again until 5.30. So, I have a big gap of time, and I definitely want to get a lot done during that time. I have an interest group meeting at 12. Then, I have to unpack. I have yet to do that yet. Then, I also have some things to get in order because we have chapter tonight, so I have to, like, get, like, my minutes in order, everything I have to say, everything I want to say. And then, I will probably leave for class, get some dinner, go to chapter tonight. I have e-board before chapter because I am the vice president. So, it definitely is a packed day. I'm excited for it because I do miss the structure and the routine of days like this. After a while, during break, I get extremely bored, so I'm definitely happy to be back in the swing of things. So, like I said, I'm going to quickly eat the cereal, get fully dressed, show you guys my outfit, and then we're going to head to Starbucks because I need coffee to get this day going. To our really dirty mirror in our living room. Anyway, this is what I'm wearing today. I'm just wearing this pearl neck. It's like a blue-gray color. It's like a t-shirt. It's not like a bodysuit. I just tuck it in. Then I'm wearing these jeans from Urban Outfitters. I think I got these like two years ago. And then my knockoff kits from Target. Super casual, yet also something that's not leggings and a sweatshirt. And then, of course, I will be wearing my teddy coat and carrying around. Yes, I still carry around just a basic black jean sport. I just filled it up with all the stuff I need. And yeah. All right, first day of classes, here I come. It's actually freezing out and I definitely do not miss walking to class. My hands are frozen because I'm the person who gets an iced coffee in 20 degree weather. Let's see if I thrive with this. Sorry for the horrible lighting, but I just finished my first class. I feel like I'm really going to enjoy that class. It also seems like a decently easy class with six tests and the lowest grade being dropped. I'm super excited for that. But I am going to go to my 
interest group meeting now. So once I'm done with that, I will update you guys more. Grabbing some sushi for lunch to eat during this meeting. I'm definitely out of shape, struggling from my walk home and my walk up the stairs to my building. But anyway, I just got home from my interest group meeting. We just like talked about like logistics of things for this semester. I also ate sushi and it was delish. I was a little hungry. I usually don't eat lunch really while I'm at school, but I was a little hungry today. So it is around one o'clock right now. Like I said earlier, my 2.30 class has been canceled, so I don't have class now until 5.30. Also, you guys are propped up because my arm gets really tired and I was just carrying my backpack, so that's why you guys are propped up. But yes, I don't have class until 5.30. So during this large gap in time, I have some emails to answer for my sorority. I have some things to get in order before chapter tonight. I also, like I said, really should probably start to unpack my stuff. So, yes, I can definitely feel the momentum of the semester picking up quite quickly. Today has been the busiest day of my life, and it's only 1 o'clock day one. So, that sucks a little bit. Also, I'm wearing my glasses, but I cannot see in class. My 2.30 class, which was the class that I had at 11, was com completely packed. First, I sat down, and I thought I was in the wrong room. I don't know why so I got up to leave and then my friend walked in the door behind me so then I really like walked in the door as I was walking out so then I realized I was in the right class so then we had to go and get seats again and the seats that I was originally sitting in and saving for us were taken so we had to sit all the way in the back of the room so that's why I had my glasses on couldn't see anything but yes now I'm going to answer my emails and all that but before that I do quickly want to show you guys a really rough room tour just in case you guys are curious and seeing the crappy living conditions at Stony Brook gives their residence so let's go do that really quick so i'm not really gonna go into my roommates or like my sweet mates rooms just because i don't know if they want me to go into their rooms but i will show you just like a rough layout of my suite. so starting at the front door here is clifford the big red dog i don't know why he's on our door but he's been there since we moved in then this is what you see when you enter the room on this side is sophia's room it used to be sophia and daniela but daniela had to move out miss her and then we have baby pictures lining this wall for our guest to guess who is who. Then you have the bathroom, shower behind the door, double sinks, all our crap underneath it, our mirror, stall for the toilet. Then you come back out. Here is our insanely messy common room. This is a lot nicer and neater. We definitely have to straighten it up. We also used to have posters on the wall, but we had to take those down. So double couch, a bunch of books I have to throw out. These are from last semester, a bunch of crap. My refrigerator, a bunch of stuff that Daniela left here. She has to come back and get that stuff. Mirror that I showed you guys my outfit in this morning. Ashley and Camille's room, but Camille moved out, so it's just Ashley's room. And then mine and Remy's room, but the room is an actual. So yeah, our room is a disaster. Me and Remy are definitely not the neatest people. I might show you it one day if it winds up being clean. But they really give us not a lot of space, so it just gets really cluttered really quickly. So that's a quick rundown of the layout of my suite. So like I said, I'm now going to sit down and answer some emails and do some more work. I'm going to probably just change into sweatpants. That's usually what I do whenever I like get off of class and come back to my room. I change into like leggings or sweatpants really quickly just because it's comfortable. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do my work and then I will update you guys on the rest of my day. All right emails done and answered everything in order so far for chapter now i have to do the dreaded unpacking i don't know why i literally hate packing and unpacking like if i had it my way and there was enough room to leave these suitcases here they would stay there until they were unpacked based on me picking clothes out to wear every day but we don't have the room they're taking up a lot of space so therefore i now have to sit and unpack them but once it's done it's done right right it'll be done soon all right i am done it really wasn't that bad my two suitcases are empty i just have that like random bag of stuff in there but i don't need to like get anything out of it at the moment or like within the next few days so i probably will leave that 
but hey, I'm feeling accomplished, feeling like I got a good amount of stuff done. It's like 2.30 now, I don't have class until 5.30, so I think I'm just going to lay in bed, probably watch some YouTube videos, do that kind of stuff before I have to leave for class, so I will see you guys when I leave for class. Alright guys, so it is around 4 o'clock now. I think I'm going to leave and go get food before class because I'm getting a little hungry and my class is kind of long. It's from 5.30 to 6.50. So I think I'm just going to eat before that. I'm just getting my stuff together right now. I have to bring like my chapter clothes with me because I don't think I want to hike all the way back to my room after my class when I have to go back to main campus an hour later. So I think I'm just going to bring my clothes with me and all that kind of stuff. Also, I'm like freezing and it's going to be dark later when I go to class, like when I get out of class and all that kind of stuff. So I need to get a scarf and get all that kind of stuff together. For chapter, all we have to wear is like badge attire or like business casual. So I think I'm just going to wear this turtleneck, but I'm going to pack my slacks and a pair of black flats to change into. So yes, I'm going to get all that stuff together. And then we can head out and I will go get something to eat. So I just got out of class. I now have like an hour and a half until my e-board meeting. So I'm just sitting in like the student activity center. I'm waiting for one of my sisters to come and join me and help kill the time. But my 310 class was okay. Like I said a few videos back, I just don't think I'm gonna enjoy going to that class. It looks hard, it's four credits, it looks boring, but we'll see about that. So I'm just gonna wait for my sister to come. We're gonna hang out, do some work, just chill. Then I will get dressed and I'll go to chapter and then that's pretty much it for the rest of the night, so. This is me, my business casual <laughs> for chapter. So we got back from chapter probably about like two hours ago. I changed into pajamas and then we were sitting in one of my roommate's rooms just hanging out and chatting but it's about 11 40 now so i am going to end the vlog and get into bed i have to be up at 8 a.m for classes tomorrow so i hope you guys enjoy this little college day in my life if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up there will be a lot more college content to come so stay tuned for all of that if you guys have not done so already head on down there and subscribe you guys know i always appreciate all the love and support that i can get I'm definitely tired, so with all that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.